Hello there, folks! My name is Walt, and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. We have got a lot to do today, so just bear with me. So first off, we're on Route 125. We're about to go into a new area called, uh, what is this the called place called again? The Shoal Cave. And I forget how to make Pokemon show up here. I think if I just walk around here. But we're gonna catch a Pokemon here, and then we're gonna see what ha- Oh, I think I've actually still got Repel on, so... Let's talk to this guy. Are you planning to go deep in there? How about bringing me back some soul salt and soul shells? I can make something good of you, bring me the ingredients. Oh, uh, well, we gotta go in there just to... Oh, crap. Don't tell me we have to... Oh, no, okay. It's just a cave. I think. I don't know. I'm... Here we go. This will tell if it's a cave or not. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Pokemon for Shoal Cave. And... Oh, it's a Swablu! Oh, my God! I, have, I can't believe I haven't mentioned this yet. Mega Altaria is so fluffy! So fluffy! All the fluff. All of it. Every little bit of fluff. It's all there. And I love it. Oh my god. I, lo I love it. I, I really do. <laughs> Although, if I really have to name my favorite... God oh. Right. Safeguard. That was dumb. Uh, so, how do I... Oh no wait, I can hit this thing without killing it, because I uh I have Rage Cage on the team because I wanted to have a designated flyer just in case anything went wrong. And I needed to get somewhere really fast. Cause you know, that could actually help. So what can I hit you with that won't kill you? Bite! Bite, bite, bite! Nom nom nom! Nope, okay. Well flinch, that's not bad. Uh how about another bite? I guess I'll just keep doing this for a bit. I mean, it helps them getting all the flinches off. That really helps. Going to fight. Nom, nom, nom. Nom. Nom, nom. Swab blue flinched. Swab blue flinched. I, I, I think I can't pronounce that any worse than I already am. But, uh, Swab blue flinched. Yay! Do do. Do do. Do do. And. Alright. Pokemon for, uh, Soul Cave is a Swab blue. I like it. I like it a lot. Swablu, the cotton bird Pokemon. A Pokemon that has wings like cottony can clouds. After enduring winter in which little food is available, Swablu flocks more closer to towns in the spring. Aw. Things adorable. Alright, uh How about This is a total cop out, but I kinda wanna do it anyway. Swablu! Get it? Get it? Uh, anyone get it? I'm counting it. Totally works. Alright. So, that's the Pokemon for this place, so... I'll meet you back when we're in Route 1 and 28. And we are back. Why are we here, you may be asking? Well, because we are right outside Route 129, where we're now gonna fish. And we're gonna catch a Pokemon here, Route 130, Route 131, and then find- God dang it! And we're gonna finally make it to the Sky Pillar. Hopefully it turn on Rayquaza so that we can actually uh, calm down uh, Gradon Kyogre so we can get to the 8th gym by next episode. Let's do it! I could not catch a Pokemon to save my life. Let's do this. Aw, oh, come on. You know you want to be caught. Oh my god. Anything. Just, I want to hook anything at this point. Come on. Oh, here we go. Yeah, Pokemon on the hook. Pokemon on the hook. And it's, it's a Graveler! Okay, it doesn't matter if it explodes, because I'm going to be sending out Miss Spooks against it. We're good. We're all good. Thank God. I had to think about that, because I had to think, what if it explodes? That's... Oh, thank God. I, I just remembered Miss Spooks was poison type, and I was like, oh, crap. <laughs> Alright, we're okay. Everything is okay. Let's see, Graveler fainted, um, hmm. Now, what do I, I guess I'll hit this guy with Shadow Punch, boom. Alright, yeah, so one more of those and I think I can start chucking Great Balls at this baby. Boop! Alright, that's two, ah, uh, you woke up, I didn't want you to wake up, oh boy. That's not what I want, that's not what I want at all. All right, there we go, Miss Spooks. Get, you know, it's always that first one that's tricky to hit. Once you get that first hypnosis off, boom, baby, boom, 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 can get them all off. I love it. 
I, I can make that work. I can totally make that work. Okay. Bulk of ball. Great ball. Chuck it at the Graveler. Ah, uh, let's go. Let's catch a Graveler, baby. Doot doot. Doot doot. Doot doot. Boom, baby. That's what I like to see. Graveler is caught. Graveler's deer was added to the Pokedex. Graveler, the rock Pokemon. They descend from mountains by tumbling down steep slopes. They are so brutal, they smash aside opposing trees and massive boulders with thunderous tackles. Wow, well, ain't you a douche. Uh... Let's go with... Bull... Boulderis. I like that, Boulderis. Although that's, I, I think that's more a guy's name than a girl's, but either way, I think it, I think it's, oh, damn it, I wasn't going to fight you. Say, hey, hey, let's get on with it. Get on with what? What, pray tell, do you want me to get on with? Because maybe I don't want a part of it. Oh, okay, if you want me to punch your syndical to death with my Gengar, I mean, I, I can make that happen. Why, why wouldn't I want to make that happen, actually? That's experience. Punch, baby. Wow, almost dead. That kind of sucks that I didn't kill it. That kind of really sucks. Alright, let's see. Come on, punch it, punch it, punch it. Punch! Boom! Oh yeah! Miss Spooks knows how to throw a punch. I love it. And next is a Meganium. Oh, that sounds like Baxter's business. Let's go ahead and get Baxter a little bit more. Let's go Baxter, baby! Let's do it! Can hurry it up. <laughs> I'm I am way too impatient to be playing Pokemon, but at the same time, like I, I love playing Pokemon. I, I really do. I, I don't know, there's just something about it. Honestly, I think I enjoy it more now that I do like almost all all Nuzlocks. Just because I like the challenge of it. Like I Well, I I suck at the challenge. I have three failed Nuzlocks that show I suck at the challenge, but I still really enjoy uh it, I love winning the challenge. That's the best part. I got. I gotta. I'll take all the losses in the world to win one challenge. Oh no! Damn it! I'm in the middle of a triathlon, but sure, why don't we battle? Yeah, yeah why don't we? I mean, I, I'm not in a hurry or anything. I'm just trying to save the world. Oh yeah, it's a Pidgeotto. Hi, Pidgeotto. I need to recover some HP on Miss Spooks. Let's see if I can get Hypnosis off. And actually do that with, uh... Never mind! <laughs> oh, that's just too unlucky. That's just too unlucky! Are, are you serious? I feel so bad! I feel so bad! Oh, that, that's just... Wow. Okay, well... <laughs> Of all the Pokemon, of all that Pokemon that Pidgeotto could have brought out to fight, it had to bring out good old Jackie Boy. I love it. Alright, Rhyhorn. Wow, six level difference between your Pokemon. Not bad. Surf attack. Whoop. And Rhyhorn is dead. So, uh, how much experience is that for Game Ran? 900? Alright, that's a good, that's good 954 experience. I can take that. I was sure I'd win. Well, hon, I'm here to dash dreams. Dash dreams and save the world. And I do both very well. Alright, Route 130. Got a fish. Fish? No. Oh! I was gonna move because I thought he was gonna keep going closer. Damn it. Wow, that sucked. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna fight you. I'm gonna kick your butt. You only got one Pokemon? It's an Aerodactyl. That's a pretty good Pokemon. Alright, let's see. Miss Spooks, you can do this. Go with Hypnosis. Miss Spooks cannot hit a Hypnosis. Bite? That's bad. But I think it, I can totally get this. I can get Hypnosis off. There we go! Yes! Alright, here we go. Aerodactyl fell asleep, and so now... Aerodactyl's fast asleep, as I'm sure we were all aware. Now we can dream eat I'm almost dead. 
Aw, oh, really? I, I stopped only one HP of full health? That's kind of annoying. Oh, well, well Aerodactyl's dead, and hopefully this will be enough for another level, although I don't think I'll make enough with just one Aerodactyl. Level 34 and all. Uh, let's see. I want to see how much experience I'm going to get for this. This could be, uh, this could be a generous amount. Uh, alright, it was, it was good. I, that was a good amount of experience. Uh, it wasn't enough, but it, by God, it was good. Alright, then, so I don't have to worry about you, so let's fish. Alright, come on. Come on, no, come on. Oh, a bite. Okay, here we go, come on. And, oh, bite. Bite. Come on. Yeah, alright, Pokemon's on the hook. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Aww, I already have one of those. Damn. Alright, well, Shadow Punch. Just kill it. No point in uh, trying to catch this thing. Well, I can't even catch this thing. It'd be against the rules, but still. Alright, 310. Alright, well, gotta get moving. Still have to get to Route 131 if we're gonna find uh, the Sky Pillar. So, I, I like this. Just sailing across the sea until we run into a person who wants to fight me. I mean, you know, I know it's kind of law that if uh, if I meet, we have to battle. But I'm on a mission to save the goddamn world. I think I'm a little exempt from the rules. Like not a lot, but just a little bit. Getting the hypnosis off, by the way. Very nice, Miss Books. Very nice indeed. All right, so Armaldo. Is, is fast asleep. Dream Meter! Woo! I don't know why I like that. I really do. I'm even doing a little twirly thing with my fingers, and it's just so much fun. Armaldo is still fast asleep. Armaldo's gonna get punched in the face while he's asleep. Armaldo's gonna faint while he's punched in the face while he sleeps. Woo! That's a... That's another good amount of experience right there. Alright. Uh, I guess that means I can switch out to someone... Uh, let's see. Who should I use? Uh, well, it's gonna know Levitate, so I can't use a Ground-type attack. Eh, you know what? Screw it. I can stick with Miss Spooks. Let's do it. Hi, Weezing! I'm gonna go ahead and use Hypnosis, and it's gonna hit you directly on! Yes! Oh, yeah! I love it. You know I love it, the way you move on the floor, Weezin. I, I see I see you are fine looking, honey, Weezin. Guess what? I'm gonna get going now. I'm gonna eat your dreams. Place them with just visions of me, baby. Okay, yeah, I know. This is very creepy. I'm I'm kind of weirded out too. But hey, we one shot Weezing! Yay! Alright, Swimmer Katie has been defeated. Like the vast blue sea, the world of Pokemon spans depths beyond belief. Okay. I'm just gonna move on now. I'm kind of in the middle of... Oh, Repels of X wore off. Hang on, I need to do that again. Because I don't want to run into, like, uh, Pokemon that are really weak. But this is Route 131, which means we got fish. Come on, fishy baby, fishy. Not even a nibble. Alright, got past him. Come on, fishy, fishy baby. Oh, oh, bite! Here we go! Oh, bite! Oh, okay, I almost missed that! Only one freaking dot? Are you serious? And... <gasps> it's a Flygon! Oh! Yo! Motherfucking fly Flygon on the scene! Flygon, more like the Fly Dawn! You know what I'm saying? I know you know what I'm saying, because I know what I know what I'm saying. So I know you know what I know what you know I know what I'm saying. What was I saying again? Anyway, uh, we can punch this thing in the face. Yeah, definitely. Let's punch it in the face. Punch! Ooh, okay, maybe a little, uh, too low there. But, oh, wow. Well, Flygon has punched himself in the face twice now. I think it is time. I think this time we're going to try for it, because it says a better ball of a higher capture rate than a great ball. I've caught everything else with a freaking great ball, but you know what? I'm going to let the Ultra Ball do its thing. 
Because I don't have a uh, zombie on me. I can't get that motherfucker. Okay, thank God. Snapped out of confusion. That's... Ooh, how much is that going to do? Alright, that's not too much. I can go ahead and stick in, use a little hypnosis. Little uh, hypnosis action. Uh, Miss Spook's really gonna. Oh. Alright, still good. Still good. I'm gonna need. I kinda need that hypnosis action. Alright, I really am really worried about leaving you in, but I kinda need this Pokemon to fall asleep, so I'm gonna do one more and hope to God you can live through it. Miss Spooks, the one time I need this. I, 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 it, it only does, uh, it doesn't do more. No! Critical God damn it! I know! I know! I know! <sighs> we lost Miss Spooks. Alright, uh, we basically need someone to take hits. Sagamaran, that's you. Oh my god. Alright, so we're just gonna chuck, uh, no, forget it. Great ball. Great balls, all the way. Forget Ultra Balls. Video evidence! Video evidence of the, of the greatness of the Great Ball over the Ultra Ball. I never want to hear anyone tell me the Ultra Ball is better than the Great Ball, because that, that's a load of shit. Flygon, the mystic Pokemon. The flapping of its wings sounds like singing. To prevent detection by enemies, it hides itself by flapping up a cloud of desert sand. Man, we lost Miss Spooks! Yes, I would. Uh... Let's see, uh, how about... A, V, A... Aviation. I like that, Aviation. Oh wow, we're on box two, holy crap. Well, uh, let me go ahead and take the item from... Guess we'll go ahead and uh, put our good buddy uh, Gamoran up front. Go ahead. And I do believe there is a town at the end of... Wait, this is... Oh, this is the Sky Pillar. Okay, I'm going to go to the town uh, in... Whoop, okay, I just want... Yeah, I wanted to make sure I wasn't going to hit this guy because... I want to make it to there's a town at the end of this that I want to make... God dang it! What's with all the goddamn trainers just sitting in the middle of the ocean like it's goddamn beach day on Tuesday? <sighs> so many trainers. So annoying. But I'm glad you sent out a rock type against my water type. That makes me a very happy Pokemon trainer. I also still can't believe my Gamoran knows goddamn Leech Seed. That's kind of amazing. Stupid, but amazing. Alright, a thousand. Very nice. Parasect, that sounds like uh, Baxter's duty right there. Baxter, you're in, baby. Let's get... I wonder what's faster, a Parasect or Baxter? I have to compare the speeds of Zombie and Baxter and see uh, who's faster, because I'm kind of curious, because... Okay, well, now I know for sure uh, Zombie is a shiny. I mean, I've kind of known for a while, but uh, that pretty much confirms it, doesn't it? <laughs> Also, uh, I guess Baxter is faster than that uh, Parasect, but I honestly didn't look at its level, so I don't know what that means. Anyway. Alright, so go above these guys, and... Yep, here we go. Alright, we're at the Pokemon Center. I can't run on this. Okay, so, well, I guess it's a floating town, so whatever. Oh, no, not yet. I gotta release uh, Pokemon real quick. I can't... Okay. <sighs> Boy, you think this late in the game I wouldn't be doing dumb shit that's getting my Pokemon killed, but nah, that's that's universal, folks. Let's face it. Aviation. Alright. 
Miss Spooks, you were awesome. You helped us get through a couple of tough gyms. And I'm sorry I got you killed because I'm an idiot. Goodbye. We lost Miss Spooks. Alright, back on the team, zombie. Let's do this. Oh, here. Might as well, since, uh, you know, we got... There we go. Alright, then. So, I still need to figure out who my six team members gonna be. Uh, need someone to replace Miss Spooks, and... That might actually be Nur, but Nur's a little too low level to just take out now, so... I don't know, I'll have to... Oh, I need to repel. Oh, I can probably fish in that town, too. Uh, I may have to remember to do that uh, before the end of this episode. Don't let me forget, folks. Uh, I've already fought you, so I can just kind of sneak by you. And... Oh, okay. Alright then, folks. We are ready to go up the Sky Pillar and figure out how do we turn on uh, Rayquaza. I don't actually know how. I just kind of came here because I figured we were supposed to. Oh, hey! Hi, Wallace! Oh, my. I'm terribly sorry. In my haste, I didn't notice I had left you behind. I've opened the locked door of the Sky Pillar. Walt, let's be on our way. It's an earthquake! There's not a moment to waste. We've got to hurry. Oh, dear. I guess that... Oh! Uh... Hmm, the situation is getting worse. This isn't good. The weather distortions are spreading even here. Walt, Rayquaza should be farther up from here. I'm worried about Sotopolis. I've got to go back. Everything is your in hands now. Don't fail us. Like you did that sentence. Alright, so I gotta go say hi to Rayquaza for everyone. Let's go do that thing. Uh, two. Three. Alright, well, so far this isn't hard. Mm, not, not, not too different. Oh. Um. Oh, okay, I get it. Oh, we need to catch a Pokemon in here, probably. Let me, uh... Oh, let me put out a Spore up front, because Spore could probably help us catch. Yeah. I should totally do that. that why wouldn't I do that? Alright, let's do it. Pokemon, Pokemon, Pokemon! POKEMON! There's a Pokemon here, right? I'll just walk around without repels for a while and see what happens. Uh, I mean, there should be Pokemon here, shouldn't there be? I don't know! The oh, yep, yeah, Pokemon! Pokemon and Pokemon for the Sky Tower is gonna be... Hi. A level 36 Cascoon. That's special. <laughs> Folks, if I ever have to use a level 30 Cascoon in this playthrough, you know I've gotten desperate and I've gotten every other Pokemon killed. Even Kabuki Joe. Even, what are other po- Even Brittany the Surskit. I've gotten everyone else on the team killed, and I'm the worst Pokemon trainer of all- I'm just gonna use an Ultra Ball on this guy. I'm- I'm sorry. Cascoon is not worth the greatness of the Great Ball. Yeah, freaking Ultra Ball better be, able to, better be able to catch that. If Cascoon had broken out of the goddamn Ultra Ball, I think I would have been pissed. Cascoon the Cocoon Pokemon. To avoid detection by its enemies, it hides motionless beneath large leaves and in gaps of branches. It also attaches dead leaves to its body for camouflage. Alright. Give a nickname to Cascoon. Uh... Ah. Ah. Oh, gee. Mon. Ah, OG Mon. <laughs> if you can figure that out, if you can figure out what I was referencing there, you are officially the most awesome person on the internet. Good luck. I, I, you will need it. Oh, right, man, to the top of the sky. Ah, uh, hi. 
So I'm ready to, uh, if I have to fight this thing, right? Uh, I should probably... I should probably at least switch into someone who might be able to take one hit from it. Hi, Rayquaza! You're not gonna attack me now, are you? I mean, we kind of have two legendaries going on a rampage, and if you could take care of those for us instead of fighting me, that... Thank you! Uh, so can I fly? I can! I get the feeling I'm supposed to fly here, so I hope I'm doing the right thing. Let's go, Raid Cage! Fly me away! Oh, here we go. We've made it back to town, and... <laughs> you do something! No, you do something! You do something! No, you do something! Think you only got that little piece of land! Us can still whoop your ass! What did I tell you two children about fighting? Oh shit! Pop's here! Oh god damn. Fucking Ozo Dragon about to come down and tell both of you to shut the fuck up. You, bi you two bitches got something to say in my presence? Say it now, or forever hold your peace! That's what I thought! Bitch-ass punks! Thanks, Quasar. Bye-bye! So, uh, we saved the world! I like it! I like it! All right, let's go talk to everyone, because <laughs> I really do love what just happened. Kyogre and Groudon both flew off to who knows where. The weather in Hoenn has returned to its normal state. <laughs> Maybe what we were trying to do was something small, even meaningless, to Pokemon. So the super ancient Pokemon weren't only Groudon or Kyogre. After all our fruitless scheming and frantic efforts, that one Pokemon's simple actions put everything right again, as if nothing had happened. <laughs> Walt, my eyes didn't deceive me. Thanks to your help, Sotopolis, no, all of Hoenn was saved. On behalf of the people, I thank you. This is a gift from me, please accept it. And we've got Waterfall, the last HM! Yes! Alright, you have the Rain Badge, a Pokemon that has learned that HM move can force its way up waterfalls. And where does one get the Rain Badge? You know, don't you? That's right, you have to beat the Sotopolis Gym Leader. When you're all set to go, step through that door. It looks like both Maxi and Archie have gone away somewhere. Perhaps they've gone to Mount Fire to return those orbs. Alright, well, I'm not gonna go check. Screw it, they can do whatever they want. World saved, I can continue my Nuzlocke adventure, and I need to pick out, uh, who is going to take the place of, uh, I'm trying to think, who should take the place of Miss, oh, well, I'm guessing Nur, I mean, Nur has gotten a bit better just because, uh, I now have ex extra sensory, which is pretty good. Powdered Snow still sucks, I gotta figure out some more. I gotta maybe look through my HMs again, see if there's something better. Uh, but overall, I guess that's something. Just kind of. Oh wait, didn't I? Yeah. Oh. Ah, OG monster, OG mon. <laughs> okay. Aviation. Let's see. Fight sand attack, faint, faint attack, and sand tomb. Uh, f decent stats, not bad. Got to levitate. Ground dragon type. Not bad. Ah, uh, just kind of thinking. How am I going to do this? Well, alright. So, Rage Cage. I'm going to go ahead. Think Nur is going to go on. And you know what? It breaks my heart. But I'm going to totally... I'm going to put Zombie away. Because I think... I think zom Zombie could never compete with Aviation. So... Zombie, you'll, you'll join the team again if I ever need you. I know I can always count on you, but 
It's a goddamn Flygon. I, I mean, I have to go with that. So, uh, that's going to be the end of this episode, folks. Next time on Walt Plays Pokemon Fusion, uh, not Fusion Generation, Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke, I will have grinded up these Pokemon up a few levels, uh, gotten Nur and Aviation up to a decent level, and hopefully take on the 8th gym, win it, and be on my way to the Pokemon League. Until then, folks, later.